a little pink heart. Oof, this is quite fun actually. Oh, this is cute! I like this. Oh, I am fun. I feel like I've got a lot of explaining to do. Also, ignore this hoodie has shrank. Like, I don't know if my head's got bigger or if this hoodie is just a lot smaller. Just ignore everything that's going on. But hi everyone, welcome back to my vlog channel. I feel like I need to explain my absence and just give you a little update on where I've been and what's been happening. As of now, as of filming this actually, it is currently the 30th of December. I haven't posted a vlog since like vlogmas day 11. Did I even film 11 days consecutively? No, because I am just very boring. And I realized that a couple days in, that vlogmas just, I don't know how I did it before. One year I actually did vlogmas from December 1st up until like February and I do not know how I did it every single day. Whilst I were at uni as well, so I actually don't know what my excuse is currently. I'm just being me, <laughs> which evidently is proving to do nothing for anyone. <laughs> but hi everyone, I hope you've had a nice Christmas. It is, as of, like I said, as of filming this, I've not really posted a vlog in two weeks. I have some explanations and some reasonings why. They will have been vlogs up until this point. You will have seen vlogs since when I'm filming this because I have a lot of vlogs that are not being edited yet that will have hopefully already gone up before this one. You're probably seeing this sometime in the new year. So if you are, happy new year. It's literally New Year's Eve tomorrow. Basically went home for Christmas, as you do. My camera, I've had this camera, oh, I don't know where she's gone. I had a camera. I used, I'm filming on a new camera, so if, if anything looks different, if I'm looking to the side, it's because I'm filming on a new camera. Treat myself for Christmas, bought myself a new camera finally, because my old one, I've had it for like four years, and I knew it was on its way out, but I'm the type of person that I take care of my stuff really, really well. So for me to have that camera for four years, as any YouTuber you will have heard them speaking about, a G7X just breaking all the time. I feel like every single YouTuber ever talks about the G7X breaking, and mine didn't break. It did break, but not like due to a fault of mine. Like the screen didn't fall off. I feel like everyone complains that the screen falls off. I insert some footage that I took whilst I were home for Christmas. The camera just isn't in focus. And it's a shame because I like that camera, but also like I felt like it was time, a new year, new upgrade to the camera. I want to vlog a lot more. I've really fell in love with my vlog channel again. So I want to, I just feel like this is gonna give me that little boost of like, oh, I have no excuse, I have all the gear now, but still no idea what the fuck I'm doing. <laughs> Official, the Christmas tree's gone. As you can see, this is my little setup. I currently have my Kindle on there. It's so annoying that this is just like this, like it's locked, but that's what it looks like. You have to pay like 50 pound more to not have an ad on your lock screen. Got my little candle, I got a nice little Jo Malone candle for Christmas. This is actually the aftershave that I wear, and I love it that much that I want my house to smell of it. So, oh, I also got these little toasters for Christmas as well. How cute. Anyway, the decorations have gone off there. I've just hoovered up. I need to actually tidy my room because since doing that, I've just been throwing things on my bed, like the Christmas lights. I forgot to pack away. I need to put these, I got some new um, actual cushion cushions for my bed for Christmas. So I need to like sort all my bedding out, but I need to wash my bed in before I start faffing around with it. So I need to tidy in here. Still have not done a single thing in my dressing room. It currently looks like this. I was trying to find my tripod, so I just emptied my suitcase on the floor. Did not successfully find a tripod. And now it's half past one. And I knew this was gonna happen. I need to leave in like 20 minutes to go and have my bloods done. I've not literally not showered or anything today, so I probably should do that. So I think I'm gonna jump in the shower and then get myself ready. I don't know how I feel about this hat. Get myself ready and actually go to the bloody doctors. Girls, um, so it turns out that now this camera has a flip screen to the side, I can't actually put you in my car. Ah, ah, that's ruined my day, that's ruined my fucking day. I have arrived at my doctor's appointment. There's nowhere to put you in my car. I was gonna do a little drive with me section, but where I normally put you is here. But the camera now that it's got the little flip screen on the side, she don't fit in there no more. Oh, my camera's zooming in, what the hell? How did I just do that? Ah. So you're just gonna have to sit on top of my steering wheel for now, but I've literally just arrived at the doctor's. My appointment's at half past, I'm here at six minutes past. So I'm now just gonna sit. I didn't think, I, I didn't realize how close the doctors were. I've been here once before, but Lewis dropped me off. And we came from Lewis's house, so I came a different way into town. And now I'm literally like, I know exactly where I am. I probably should have walked, but it's raining, so maybe I shouldn't have walked actually, because it's absolutely chucking it down. I know it looks absolutely no different since last time I picked my camera up, apart from me not balancing on here. Um, but I've literally just got out of the doctors. I've had my blood done. Not me listening to Sam Fender. And yeah! 
we find out. She said I might get my results back tomorrow, which is really good because then I get to find out whether or not I'm a hypochondriac. If I am a hypochondriac, I'm not telling anyone. So if you don't hear about any new diagnoses, it's because I'm embarrassed that I've gone to the lengths of going to the doctors because I am lazy. Anyway, I'm going to drive home now. Potentially pop to the florist. Florist? It's called Flourish. Flourish. And it's a florist. Little tongue twister there. Hunt for a plant was a big fat fail. It is now time to tackle this mess. I can't find. I have a tripod that's like this, but it's a lot taller, so I can like put it on things and then it like goes can go higher. Anyway, it's just a lot taller than that. Don't know where it is. Like I said, I turned my room upside down earlier looking for it. Now it's time to tackle all this mess and get some organisation to this room. Someone once said to me, the longer flowers last shows how much the person bought you, shows how much the person that bought you loves you. Is that right? Does that sound right? Anyway, Louis got me them for our anniversary and they've lasted way over a month, so. They are dying, but the vibes, that you know what I mean, the vibes, the vibes. I'm now gonna sit in this exact seat and edit, I think I'm gonna edit a vlog actually. But before I do anything, I'm gonna make myself a cup of tea in this mug. I need to rinse it out though, it's been in my bag. But I got this from Typo. It's the biggest mug literally in the world. I think it's actually a soup. I think it's a soup thing. I'm gonna have a massive cup of tea in there. You can't really see the size of it, but I have big hands and I mean my hand still looks big next to it. But let me just show you next to a normal mug. A normal size mug compared to like do you know what I mean? Lovely. For people that love cups of tea, bloody gorgeous. I was saying to the woman actually whilst I were getting my blood done, um, we were just talking, having a little chat, talking about the daylight and how we feel robbed of it. And I feel like I go on about this in every single video. We actually had the longest day of the year the other day. So it means it's gonna start getting lighter from, from now on. It's going to start getting lighter again, which is absolutely incredible. I cannot wait for the dark evenings to be over. It's currently 5 o'clock in the evening, and it's pitch black, and I feel like I'm ready to go to bed. I really want to do something with this today, but I just don't think I'm going to be able to, because I want to spray paint it. And I learned from last time that I probably should spray paint outside, because I got dust everywhere, like paint dust. And it's raining, so I think what I need to do is I need to like cut the sides off because it's all like overflowing over the side. So I think I'm gonna chop that off and just put it on my wall as is so I can clean up this room. This is honestly the most satisfying thing ever. It literally just like slices off. I mean, the noise is horrible, but. Ah! Ta da! They're like bones. I've literally just spent the last like hour editing up a vlog. I couldn't actually film anything whilst I was doing it because this SD card was in my laptop. So it is now about an hour later. I'm all dressed. Were I dressed before? What were I wearing before? I literally can't even remember today. I feel like I was just wearing a vest and a jumper. I can't even remember what I've done today. I've changed my outfit basically. I have just freshened myself up, had a bit of a shower. I have not washed my hair. I say a bit of a shower because I've not washed my hair. But I've just done my hair a little bit, put some product in it. I've got this jacket on, which I've actually had for ages. I wanted to spice it up a little bit with a bit of colour, so I've just got this on, the jeans that I had on earlier, and then these shoes, which I've not worn since park life, and now I've treaded mud all around my floor, which is amazing. This is what my little art piece is looking like. I can't spray it tonight, obviously, because it's raining, but I am, in fact, going to go to Lewis's house because he's making a little roast dinner. Well, he's making bangers and mash with, like, broccoli and cauliflower and all the rest of it, so I'm going to head over there now, go to Lewis's house for the evening, and yeah. That's the plan, Stan. Right, so in the vlog that I actually edited today, I were talking about Lucy's Christmas present. It's way past the time of giving the present and everything. I was just talking about how excited I was to give it in. And it reminded me that now I can actually show you what I got. So I basically found this alarm clock that makes you a coffee. Like, you can either make it on the, as the alarm sounds, it'll make you a coffee. Or you can have it so it makes you a coffee before, like five minutes before you wake up. Hold on, let me just put that in. Put that in the top. Like that. Yeah. We need to like push it in. The bottom, oh. yeah. Hold that. Yeah, there you go. I've spent so many times in bed, aren't I? I've lost my pen. Oh, I bet not leaked there. Oh, it's not there. Spent, I didn't spend eight hours cleaning the room today, so. <laughs> Why is it taking that long? I don't know. So, do you want to go first or should I? Well, I don't know the game. Well, do you want to go first or should I? Right, so I'm going to start saying the alphabet. Alright, and then you've got to say stop the bus. Okay. A, B, C, stop D, D. Bus. 
Right, so you need to think of a name, famous person, brand, country, all of that, and D. We need a timer. Alexa, 30 second timer starting now. Um, ah! <laughs> right. I did initially put Darock. <laughs> so, okay. name, what did you get? I got Damon. Dan. Famous person. Why did I not think of Dan? Daniel Radcliffe. Daniel Radcliffe, yeah. Brand. Dior. Ooh, Debenhams. Ooh. Country. Denmark. Denmark, yeah. Shop. Dyson. Dunlop. <laughs> Animal. Dog. Dog. Disney character. Donald Duck. Duck. <laughs> I put Darock. I like Panic Darock. <laughs>